Hey everybody, it's your hospitality friend Glenn here, still on the show floor at The Hospitality Show. This time I found Scott Strickland, Chief Commercial Officer with Wyndham. But first I want to thank our sponsor, Integra, Unmatched Purchasing, Unlimited Performance. Check them out at IntegraPS.com. Great to see you. Our first time doing an interview together on yes, camera. Yes. Thank you for grabbing me, Glenn. Uh, yeah, this is absolutely great. I'm super excited to talk to you because technology now is at such an interesting point, uh, a weird inflection point. How are you thinking about it in your new role in the company? And how is that going to help you get closer to customers, help improve profit margins for your owners? Lots of questions. I know, all at once. So, fast. I, my whole idea is just to now I can shut up for the next 45 minutes. That, that, yeah, <laughs> that won't happen. Yeah. <laughs> Someone knows me. <laughs> so I'm really excited about the new role. Yeah. It was natural as we looked at our owner first philosophy and what we're trying to yeah. do with our guests. Technology basically enables all of it. So, take for example on the guest side. Mm -hmm. How do we let the guests get what they want before they come to the hotel? Right. So we implemented AI is the buzzword nowadays. Oh, it is. We implemented something called Wyndham Connect. Mm -hmm. It lets them order upgrades, lets them check in early, check in later, lets them converse with an AI before they arrive. What time's the pool open? Right. What time is breakfast? Do I get breakfast? I, All before they come in. I love that. So you're creating more upsell opportunities before they even walk in the door. Before they come in. And then they have peace of mind. Right. Because they know I do have early checkout. Let's mm -hmm. say I'm there with a sports team or tomorrow I have late right. checkout because, well, my daughter's game doesn't start until four. Yeah. Right. So they can re they'll, they'll know that ahead of time and they'll have that. that right. I, I think we're in a, in a world right now where the, the fewer questions we have going into a situation, the more it builds confidence and particularly um, against the brand. That way you can really feel more connected. To the brand is what I'm trying to. That's exactly say. right. And it provides brand consistency yeah. because then people learn this is associated with La Quinta Days Inn or Super A and they just come to expect that. Mm -hmm. Now flip that around. Our owners, our franchisees, right. 6,000 franchisees now mm -hmm. can have a more efficient experience. They don't have to answer that call and say, what time is breakfast? Right. They don't have to tell when the pool's open because the messaging AI is handling it. Oh, and by the way, those franchisees, they're earning money on those early check in and late check outs. Mm -hmm. Yeah. 50%, 50% of the people who've implemented Wyndham Connect, so we have 4,000 right. retails right now, uh -huh. are uh -huh. making $1,500 or more a month. What? That's just revenue that's coming in. And yeah. think about for a Super A, you know, or a smaller roadside hotel, that is real money. Yeah, and it is real money, particularly, guys, because you know we're, uh, we're, we're living in a world where it's getting harder to push up those rates. Consumers are starting to feel those pressures, and owners are feeling the pressures as their expenses continue to rise, creating a narrowing of profitability. So you want to figure out ways in order to make it easy for the customer to spend more money. And for select service hotels where you have your bread and butter, it's so hard to find those revenue opportunities, but here you are finding some. We are yeah. on their behalf yeah. and allowing them to be more efficient. That's a, that's pretty exciting. All right, so uh, before we turned on the, the microphone, we said the two letters, AI, right? The reason why we don't like talk about it in general is because it's really becoming a part of everything that we do. How are you seeing it in your ability? I mean, you teased it with like the messaging and stuff like that. But how do you see it in the terms of being able to get closer to the customer while reducing costs? So closer to the customer for us, we're enabling AI on channels where guests want to use it. So if you want to, you can right now go in and modify your reservation, cancel reservation without talking to a single person. You can reset your win and rewards password. Mm -hmm. Some people love to do that. Some people want to do that on their chatbot. Right. Some people want to do that on their app. Some people want to call a person. Some people want to talk to an AI. We have it all. That's great. So for a guest, that's, that's real value. Choices. Choices, yes, exactly. And serve them on the channel they want to be served mm -hmm. upon. Right. As we think about the future for us on AI, it's about learning more about you. Yeah. So Glenn, Glenn comes into a hotel. Oh. Yesterday, I was just north of here. We have a new build, La Quinta. Yep. They're stringing fiber everywhere. They've got the IoT sensors around. Well, why? Because that way we know what temperature do you like your room? Right. What channel do you like? How do you like your lighting? I'll be able to put all of that into your loyalty profile. I love it. And now when you check in, using all of that data and understanding your preferences, have your room ready and set for you. I love it. You select service hotel. All right. So... I've been saying this now for 20 years. Maybe you guys could do it for me. I want to I wanted to see everything that you're talking about right now. 
but maybe some of the artwork could be video screens and it'll have my preloaded family pictures on or things that I want to have in there as well to make it a more homey experience for me. Not out of the realm of possibility? No, it's not. I just not. want one of you guys to do it already so uh, I could, you know, feel good about my It's so, digital real estate. Ones. I mean, there's yeah. digital real estate right. sitting there on the wall. And, uh, so, and on that. So, yeah. too. Yes, we can. Uh, well, uh, I, I think that's pretty good. That's a pretty good idea uh, over there. Um, what are you most excited about in this job, man? Long list. Damn. I'm most excited about really leaning into and amplifying our loyalty program. Yeah. Seven years in a row, we win the award for the best loyalty in the world. Mm -hmm. Okay. How do I bring that to life for people? Yeah. And one of the ways I can bring that to life is you stay at a Super 8 for six, seven, eight times. Suddenly, you have enough points to go stay at an all-inclusive in Greece. You have enough points to go stay at a $600, right. $800 a night hotel. All-inclusive. Nobody else can offer that in the industry. That is a value cop for yeah. us. And then how do we look at offering experiences? Mm -hmm. Some people don't want just rooms. Maybe right. they're staying this because they want an experience. We just signed a partnership with uh, Penn State University. Cool. You want to know what's that going to be for? On state, ex on uh, field experience? Uh-huh. We can give you one. Right. That's awesome. You want to build bid on a football game? We right. can give you one. Right. Right. Those sorts of experiences that we can expand yeah. loyalty. In. Right. And what he's talking about experience is really about access, giving people things they could not get anywhere. You know, a lot of hotels out there, it's really a fungible environment, particularly in the select service hotels. So you got to find new ways to make that connection that's going to last a lifetime. Before we wrap up, how are you thinking about, um, you know, overall using technology in order to streamline uh, purchasing and lower the cost of items and all of that kind of stuff? Absolutely critical yeah. in every environment. But as the franchisees look at their total bottom line. It's not just about top line ADR right. that you were speaking to. It's also, what can I remove out of the middle? How can I remove some of my costs? With our scale, with Wyndham's scale, we need to be able to offer our franchisees ultimately a right. portal. Mm -hmm. And we're teasing something that we're going to have a big yeah. announcement on where they can come in and they can use our scale to understand, here's the price of a mattress. Here's price of coffee. Oh, sweet. Here's the price of chicken breasts. Mm -hmm. Whatever it may be that you need to order, we can pre-negotiate some of those savings on your behalf. Excellent. I love that idea. We'll have to get you on the full episode of uh, No Vacancy when you uh, you do all of them. We're going to make an announcement. I'd love that. Thank you, Scott. I want to thank you guys for watching today. What a fun episode this was. You witnessed the first, our first interview together. So very excited to put this in a time capsule and pull it out in, a, More to come. in 20 years. More to come. I'm Glenn Housman. That's uh, Scott Strickland. That's Integra. Check him out. And be sure to subscribe to our newsletter. Text the word HOTEL to 66866 and get our roundup every Sunday. Thanks so much for watching. Bye-bye.